Hello friends. In this video we are going to train a dream booth model using the AI Painter app on photos of an Indian actress. We will then use the trained model to generate artistic images using different text prompts. I will be using images of Shraddha Kapoor downloaded from the internet. You can use your or images of your friends or family. AI Painter is based on a powerful open source diffusion model called Stable Diffusion. The model is capable of creating beautiful art form based on just a text prompt. Dream Booth is another deep learning technique that can embed a new concept into the art form. Usually you have to go through the hassle of setting up servers to train a Dream Booth model, but using AI Painter it becomes super easy. All you have to do is collect some images, zip them, upload on a web form and hit submit. Once the model is trained you can create awesome photos using the generate image functionality. So let's get started. So I have downloaded some image of Shraddha from Google. Some of the images are headshots, some from chest and up and some are full body image. Images that are without makeup works best. Next we are going to crop them into 512 by 512 images. To do this I will be using Burmi.net. This is an excellent website which is very simple to use and only runs on your local computer. Nothing goes back to the cloud. All we have to do is drag and drop all images to Burmi site. After that change the crop size to be 512 by 512. Resize images so that the main focus is on the person. Once satisfied with the cropping click on save as zip file. Next we will head over to the AI Painter app to start the Dream Booth model training. Choose a unique job name that will identify this job. I will use the name of the actress and the number of steps I am going to train on. Next choose a class name for this job. A class name is a category name that identifies the object you are training on. Usually it is a common noun for the object of training. I will use the class woman for this training. If you are training on photos of man use man as the class name. If you are using an object use the object category like water bottle, cup, shirt etc. Next will. Upload the zip of the image that we downloaded from burmi.net. Now choose the number of steps we need this algorithm to train for. A good rule of thumb is to use 100 times the number of images in the zip file. I think we had around 27 images so let's put it at 2700 steps. Click Submit. Now the image went to cloud server and the training of the Dream Booth model started. You can check the status of the job by clicking on the My Training Jobs. You will also get an email once the training is finished. You can also download the model after training and generate images on your local computer. I will upload another video on how to use a custom model locally. Now we will generate some images using the trained model. Go to the generate images and choose the newly trained model. We can generate images in square, portrait and landscape size. I will be using the portrait size. You can also configure how many images you want. You can generate up to 100 images in one go. All the prompts that I am using will be available in the video description for you to try out. In prompts you should always have the SKS woman phrase, otherwise the form will give error. SKS woman is a concept that algorithm uses to generate Shraddha Kapoor. First I will be generating images related to the Christmas theme. Next. 
Now I will be generating images related to digital art theme with flowers. Next I will be generating images with Shraddha as a 3D video game character. Last generation will be Shraddha Kapoor in a horror movie. That's it guys. Head over to AIPainter.com and create cool images of yourself or your loved one. Goodbye.